Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Luxembourg took a historic step in bolstering its national defense capabilities on May 8, 2024, with the announcement of a groundbreaking 2.6 billion euro investment, the largest in its history, aimed at modernizing its armed forces. Defense Minister Yuriko Bacchus, alongside Army Chief of Staff General Steve Thull, unveiled a new defense bill outlining plans to acquire a fleet of cutting-edge armored vehicles, including French-made Griffin, Jaguar, and Serval vehicles. The investment represents a significant commitment to enhancing Luxembourg's military prowess and ensuring interoperability with NATO and European Union forces, particularly those of neighboring Belgium and France. Over the next three decades, Luxembourg plans to acquire 16 Griffin multi-role armored vehicles, 38 Jaguar armored reconnaissance and combat vehicles, and 5 Serval light multi-role armored vehicles. These acquisitions will substantially augment the operational capabilities of the Luxembourgish army, aligning it with modern defense standards and strategic requirements. Minister Bacchus underscored the critical importance of this investment, emphasizing Luxembourg's commitment to remaining a reliable partner within international defense frameworks. The acquisition encompasses sophisticated weapon, protection, and communication subsystems tailored to the Army's operational needs, ensuring readiness and effectiveness in diverse operational scenarios. Importantly, the modernization effort aims not only to strengthen military strength but also to integrate seamlessly with Luxembourg's existing assets, such as the CLRV vehicles acquired in 2022. Full integration of these new vehicles with existing systems is anticipated by 2025, in alignment with the French Scorpion program, facilitating enhanced operational synergy and effectiveness. The Luxembourgish government's decisive move to bolster its military capabilities through this substantial investment signals a pivotal stride in its defense strategy, consolidating its position as a formidable and technologically advanced military force in Europe. The Luxembourg army, comprising approximately 900 soldiers, prioritizes flexibility and interoperability within international frameworks. Notably, its reconnaissance forces, including two reconnaissance companies, contribute to Eurocorps, a Belgian division, and a NATO pool of deployable forces, underscoring Luxembourg's active engagement in multinational defense collaborations. Presently equipped with 48 Dingo 2 4x4 armored vehicles, the Luxembourg Army demonstrates proficiency in protected mobility and reconnaissance tasks. Anti-tank capabilities are reinforced by MANPAT's NLAW and tow missile systems, augmenting anti-armor and anti-infrastructure capabilities. Additionally, Luxembourg maintains an artillery component equipped with 681mm mortars, bolstering indirect fire support capabilities. Luxembourg's decision to allocate 2.6 billion euros towards military upgrades reflects a substantial commitment to enhancing combat capabilities, coinciding with a notable increase in defense spending. The country's defense budget saw a remarkable rise of 40.01% from 2021 to 2022, reaching $0.56 billion. This surge in spending underscores a strategic shift towards fortifying Luxembourg's military infrastructure. The significant financial investment aims to procure advanced armored vehicles and upgrade existing military equipment, bolstering Luxembourg's operational and strategic defense capabilities. The acquisition of modern multi-role armored vehicles, reconnaissance and combat vehicles, and light armored vehicles, equipped with state-of-the-art weapon systems and interoperable communication tools, promises to significantly enhance Luxembourg's defensive and offensive capabilities across various fronts. Furthermore, the investment underscores Luxembourg's commitment to fulfilling its obligations within international defense frameworks, contributing more effectively to NATO and EU operations. By prioritizing advanced technology and interoperability with European allies, Luxembourg positions itself to respond decisively to joint operations and peacekeeping missions. In summary, the augmentation of Luxembourg's defense budget and the targeted investment in military capabilities reflect a broader strategy aimed at reinforcing national security and upholding commitments within international defense alliances. Through concerted efforts to modernize its armed forces, Luxembourg reaffirms its status as a reliable and capable partner in safeguarding regional and global security. That's all for now. See you later.